Hey everybody, um, I'm so happy to be making this video. Um, since my last video, a lot has happened. I now have my own salon with um, a pretty full staff of girls that are amazing. I'm so excited, but it has been very busy for me um, because I have not been able to make my videos, but trying to get everything up and running. But um, I'm excited to be back to have this video for you on this simple side braid updo um if you see me at any time during the week like i probably have this hairstyle it is perfect for when you're on the go you don't have a lot of time to do your hair you wake up and your hair is crazy um this is one of my favorite go-to everyday styles um it's also great for if you want something simple for a wedding or a prom um and also i have extensions and it is an easy way to add a braid in your hair whenever you have extensions because you use elastic so if you have a lot of different layers going on this is the perfect style for you so I hope you enjoy it please um comment and let me know if you want um or what you want to see like for more videos because um, me and my staff are going to get a bunch of these rolling for you so thank you stay tuned as you can see, my hair is super wild and frizzy today. So the first product I'm gonna use is Speechless by IGK. It is a dry oil spray to help combat frizz, and it's also great to use on your body. I'm going to distribute the product through my hair using my wet brush um, just to comb out everything. It's also great a great brush to use if you have hair extensions like I have, as well as the style is really good for you as a quick style if you also have hair extensions. To start this style, first I would take the top half of my hair, starting at the opposite side of where I want my side braid to go, and pull it over to the opposite side, as you can see, making sure everything's covered in the back, um, and pulling the front top half of my hair to meet right by my ear, and then I'm going to um, take a clear elastic. You can get those at Sally's, anywhere, the drugstore. Um, I don't have a particular brand I love, I just always use clear. And then I secure it with the elastic. Next, I make a hole right above the elastic and just flip that section through the hair and tighten it up just a little bit. And it makes just like a little topsy tail as we call it. Um, and then I start on my next section. Pretty much continuing to do the same thing on the next section, but since it is the bottom of my hairline and the last section, like um, from the opposite side, I like to make sure this one is really secure because it anchors in your hairstyle. Now we're gonna do another loop um, and secure it really good with the elastic. Then make another hole and flip it through, making sure we tighten it up and that everything's anchored in. There's been times I have had my hair curled when I start to do this, and I might just leave the hairstyle exactly like that, and it's still really pretty, but we are gonna continue on since I'm making a break today. Since we got the two big sections done, now we're focusing on just the braid part. And what I do is I grab two sections from the ponytail area from the back and pull them to the front and then flip it again and tighten it up. And then I continue to do the same thing like all the way down. Um, I just love this hairstyle so much like I cannot rave enough great things about it just because really it can like take you five minutes and you look like you spent so much time on your hair which i know we all have crazy busy lifestyles so this is something that is really easy if you woke up late for work or if you know you're just having like a crazy day that you can look put together really quickly an important thing to remember when doing this style is that the smaller of sections you take, um, the more intricate your braid will look. I will do that if I am, uh, you know, 
going to work or if I'm going on a date night with my husband or if I'm in a formal event, you want your braid to look a little bit fancier. But then on the flip side of that, um, you could take bigger sections if you're just in a hurry to get it done. I do this if I work out because it's an easy way to keep my hair secure during my workout because the elastics do all the work for you. Sometimes with a traditional braid, you know, you'll have um, pieces that poke out and come loose. And whenever you do this style with the clear elastics, everything stays in place. Another important thing to remember is as you get to the last few sections of your braid, leave um, a few inches of hair out below because after we finish doing all the elastics, we are gonna spread the braid out and make it big, um, just like the braids on Pinterest that everybody loves. And it's so much easier to make your braid big when you have elastics versus a regular braid because it'll still be secure. Then after I do my last section, I just take another elastic and tie it at the end to secure everything. Next, I'm gonna take my Whitney Evans Beauty Insta Beauty Hairspray. I'm gonna use the setting on medium. We have three different levels of spray for our hairspray. I'm choosing medium for this style because it gives me enough hold, but also lets my hair still be manageable to finish out my style. Then I'm gonna take a long bobby pin and just secure my layers in the back and my baby hairs. This is a really good trick if you have issues of little hairs flying away. And then making sure I have some wispies around my face I, just to soften my style. And then I start to loosen my braid. The key to pulling out your braid successfully is just to do it gently, section by section. Don't pull too hard until you get to the desired thickness of your braid. After you get your braid to where you want it to be, this next product is amazing. I love it so much. We also use it for curls, but it's by Redken and it's their Triple Dry 15. It just adds that little bit of volume and texture to any style you want to. And I just give my whole head a quick spray. And this is the final look. Thank you all so much for watching. Please comment and let me know what you think and follow us at Whitney Evans Beauty on Instagram. Thank you.